Yoga streamers, we're back in bloom just like the cherry blossoms. Right, right. Let's dive right into Just Stream trivia. The question for today is, when is prom? Stay tuned to the end for the answer. And don't forget to follow Jets Flyover on Instagram. Girl Scouts were my childhood dream since I was in elementary school. I truly wanted to be a part of that group. Me too. So we relived our childhood last weekend at World Thinking Day. I loved it. Also, Haley and Grace covered the Keysack Boys Volleyball Tourney. I'm Rena Lee. And I'm Serena Travers. We've got these stories and more on today's Jet Stream! These stories and more on today's Jet Stream. Girl Scouts are so cute. The Scouts from all over Daegu gathered here for a special day. Yes, it was like never before because of two special editions. Let's see how the DIS campus was full of energy. Check it out! This is Serena Travers. Today is a big day for DIS. There are three events going on this campus right now. Let's dive right into it! Girl Scouts were thinking they invited people from all over Daegu. Also, there was a drama club performance and a book fair too. Let's start with the book fair. The book fair is held in the dorm. Look how much books there are. I can even learn about Leonardo da Vinci. Book fair is a very traditional event in the school, and this year we are very interesting for joining the DIS book fair. This is a very initial stage in DIS, so we bring here around 500 titles and a total 2,500 books. So it's a uh, both part is good. good Good, good event, actually. Yeah, yeah. Next event is the Girl Scout event with the Drama Club performance. It's in the gym. Let's go. It's an opportunity for girls from different communities of Girl Scouts in Korea to get together and to learn together, to make friends um, and to have fun. One of our laws is to be a sister to every Girl Scout, and so that's what our event is, to be a sister to our Korean Girl Scouts and our Daegu International Girl Scouts. So we have a number of different activities for the girls. They can make a bookmark with recycled materials, and then they can keep one and give one to a new friend. They can do Lego challenges. They can make recycled art sculptures. They can make friendship bracelets. We're gonna enjoy lunch together, and then an outdoor scavenger hunt. This event. I like whenever we get to come together with the Korean Girl Scouts and the DIS. It's always fun for it to be like all of us together. <laughs> we get to know about all the Girl Scouts and lastly we made a big circle and I sang a song. I really liked it. So one important feature that was added this year was the drama club performance. So we we're really grateful that the drama students were willing to come on a Saturday to perform um, and the message was really great. We wanted to put on a message of, uh, you know, getting along and working together to solve problems um, because, you know, this is Girl Scout World Thinking Day. And so we wanted to show the girls that, like, we could resolve our differences and end and with kindness. It was a busy day. I was running around all campus to take pictures, but it was a really, really fun day. Hope you guys enjoyed. Back to the studio. All those Girl Scouts right here at DIS. The singing really touched me at the end. For me, the drama performance was so enjoyable. I could see how much effort they put in. The gym has been packed lately. We also hosted a huge sports tournament. Next up is Grace and Haley's video about the amazing games of the middle school boys volleyball team. 
Hey Jets, today I am at the middle school boys volleyball Kisek tournament with Haley. There are six different teams competing against each other. These kids from Jeju are really big. Let's see how the young athletes showcase their skills and teamwork. <laughs> on your team who worked hurt yesterday and today? I, I mean, I'm proud of everyone. Uh, you know, I asked a lot of them. I, like, challenged them, made them work even harder than they've been working. Everyone's improved immensely, like, even from Monday when we were in the SCAC tournament. All our teams have played really well. I'm super proud of them. I'm excited for our next couple matches. I want our kids to feel good about how they played. Like, I want them to feel really proud of themselves no matter what. If they won or if they lost, like, I still want them to feel like they and know that they've improved and because um, better teammates, better players, because a lot of our boys were going to lose them next year going into high school. So I want them to have that celebration to know, like, in their mind that they did really, really well, and um, I'll miss them next year. What is one thing you like about volleyball? Um, definitely um, the teamwork that we have to put in. Since a volleyball, we can't play on our own, and we have to communicate with our teammates, and I love that. Um, I could talk with my friends and to play volleyball together. What well, went well, and what can you improve for the next tournament? Um, we had a hard time communicating, I think, for the tip covers, and we had some hard times putting our serves, but um, we definitely did put in uh, lots of good attacks and defense. You know, we could improve on, you know, talking, telling, uh, coordination of the volleyball court. Um, we were able to uh, host a very successful event. Uh, we got a lot of positive feedback. A lot of our uh, SAC members, our student athlete uh, advisory committee, did a great job helping out, keeping scores. Um, the refs did a really good job, so the, the tournament was a, a positive event that uh, really looked good for DIS. Uh, I feel like the DIS team did really well, coming out in third place, and against uh, other Jeju schools with thousands of kids, coming out third is really amazing for a school with only 300 people. What are your final words? Keep playing volleyball, keep practicing. More people could join MS Volleyball for next season, and um, I hope that the next year team could also win the tournament. It's a great tournament. Maybe next year the JV team, if obviously the team can win. Uh, I'm excited for next year KISAC. I have high hopes for the future teams and let's go win another trophy. Go Jets! We're looking forward to hosting more in the future. Um, I know it's difficult when we have smaller uh, courts and fields like uh, unlike the uh, Jeju schools, but I think it's really good and I hope that in the future when we are hosting that more people come out and support the kids. As the final is of blows, we wrap up the middle school boys volleyball Kisak tournament. Congratulations to the Jets for their outstanding efforts and winning third place out of the all other great teams. Until next time, keep spiking, setting, and digging. Whoa, I didn't know middle schoolers were that good at volleyball. Not gonna lie, I was kind of surprised. Congrats to the coaches and athletic director for organizing such a great weekend. I agree, it's crazy. You know what's more crazy? Spring break is in a week! Also, the high school futsal teams hold their first friendly match at DMHS on Tuesday. And the answer to today's trivia question, when is prom, is June 8th. Stay tuned for details about how to buy your prom tickets. Well, anyway, that's it for today. Follow Flyover on Instagram. Hey everybody, it's about that time again. Shout it out with us! Be sure to stay... Determined, Intellectual, and Successful! Just my name and no more yeah what get back that out when and get up so so Just my name and no more Yeah, yeah.